And just like that, the next episode has begun. Welcome back to Ace Attorney. This is Brawl. I'm your host, Mega Shadow. Mega Shadow. If it's like a video game, it's like a commentary. And we're interviewing the great Max Galactica, the circus magician from the country, from the heartland, it seems. So let's go ahead and continue. <coughs> Ahem. I must apologize for not being my absolutely fabulous self just now, sweetie. Uh, huh? Mr. Attorney. Yes? A few minutes ago, you talk you took one of my cards, didn't you? Hmm? Now that he mentions it, I did take a card. It was the Ten of Hearts, right? What? How'd he, how'd he get it right again? What can I say? You too. You've stolen some of my most valued possessions. Ten of Maximilian Galactica's hearts. You sure do have a lot of hearts, don't you? <laughs> I'm putting my faith in you, sweetie. He didn't just call me sweetie, did he? All right, let's make this an absolutely fabulous case. Come on, Nick. All righty then. So before we begin, can we psych lock this just yet? If not, it doesn't matter. We're gonna save first of all, because why not? You would save in this situation, wouldn't you, ladies and gentlemen? Don't answer that question. I know you would. You don't have to lie to me. I mean, if you lie to me, then you're lying to me. You see what you see what I did there? From save point, I almost went from chapter start. Ugh, that would have been really well. That wouldn't have been that bad in this case, but you know, imagine if I was like three quarters of the way into this case and I did that. Okay, before we begin, uh, let's go with Maya's Magatama and see if we can break some of these psych locks. All right, let's see what we got here. <clears throat> okay. I doubt we're gonna have any. E we don't have any. Wait a minute. What am I doing? We don't have any evidence whatsoever. We don't know anybody. Why am I doing this? Okay, I'm. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna avoid all this. Blah 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 blah. We're, we're, we're gonna read this all dramatic, like in the next one. That's the truth. The whole truth. What do you mean? I just went to this office to negotiate your new salary. I hate lies and liars even more. What are you insinuating? Any proof that I did something other than negotiate my fee last night? Okay, so we'll read it all dramatic, like next. I don't think I have enough evidence yet. I should investigate and gather some more clues before I try again. All right, we don't have any evidence yet, but we need to look for something that proves that he was doing something else. Okay, so all we can really do is move to... Oh, I didn't even know that we could go to the circus entrance just yet. Should we go to Ryan Curry Law Offices first? Nah, let's go to circus entrance. <clears throat> December 28th, Berry Big Circus, circus entrance. We're here again! Yep, but this time we are here for work. It hasn't been that long since the crime, so the police are still on the scene, which means gumshoe, correct? Let's find someone who might know something about what happened. Sounds like a plan. Alright. First of all, let's go ahead and examine stuff. Ah, <sighs> jeez. Let's examine this. Yeah, it looks like the hitbox for this entire thing. Okay. It's a snack stand. They have hot dogs, hamburgers, and drinks. Not to mention... Candy and popcorn! They've even got snow cones! Who would eat snow cones in the middle of winter? My sister. Nick! Do you think we can buy some snow cones? Look around, there's t there's tons of snow piled up all around here. Yay! Wait a sec! Second, there's no syrup though! I want syrup! Hopefully she doesn't notice that discolored snow in the corner. That's not syrup. Yuck. Yuck. Uh, there's no- I mean, who- I mean, besides, you should- Save your money for buying hot dogs from Larry Butts. You shouldn't be- You should only be buying hot dogs from Larry Butts. Hmm, this door must lead to the lodging house. No entry to unauthorized personnel. Do you really need to say no entry if no one's actually entering? It's almost like a Zen riddle, isn't it, Nick? I'm not even going to justify that question with a response. I bet all the stars stay at that- Stay at that lodging house. Okay, very big circus. Nick, the interest is right here. Maya, the circus is closed today. No clowns, no elephants, no shows. I know that! Nick, you can get your picture taken with Dolly the Elephant! There's no Dolly, not today. I know that too! Oh well, I'll just have to take a picture with whoever I stumble across. <sighs> it's not like we're here on business or anything. Yeah, you're right, Phoenix. See if there's anything- what's this? Those streamers do a nice job introducing the circus performers. Maximilian Galactica and his comical comrades. You know, you don't really see too many streamers nowadays, do you? You're right. I haven't seen one in ages. I bet they stopped using them due to little kids climbing up at the top. Um, I don't think that was why. 
It possibly it could have been. You never know. Uh, anything around here? What is, is this like? Is this still? This is the box office where they sell all the tickets for the circus. They all sell programs. I forgot to buy one when we came to the circus last time. So then, why don't you buy one now? Hmm. Sounds like a plan. Oh no! It looks like I forgot my wallet. If you want me to buy it for you, just ask me already. You know I'd never do that to you, Nick. Okay, whatever. Is this still the same thing? Nick, the entrance is right here! Maya, the circus is closed- Okay, yeah. We've already seen all that. So, it looks that looks like everything that we can examine here today. So, let's go ahead and move. To- Oh, we have all sorts of things that we can- We can go to Big Top. Or Lodging House Plaza. Mm, we're go we'll go to Big Top first. They probably want to. Let's see here. December twenty eighth, Barry Big Circus, Big Top. The circus stage sure doesn't look like this small from out in the audience. Wow, this is where they all perform, isn't it? Nick, do some somersaults. I'm not doing any somersaults. Why not? You look like you'd be a great at it. Why do I look like I'd be great at somersaults? Grrr! Huh, Nick? It wasn't me. It's a oh, it's it's oh, okay, it's a tiger. I thought it was a person. Tiger! He's coming out. He's coming this way. No, this has to be a person in like a tiger suit or something. Ah! I don't think it's an actual tiger. Maybe. Nick, you're too young to die. Nick, stay. Stay hill. Okay, so now it's a tiger combined with uh, like a like a whatever you call the tiger people. Grrr, grrr. Okay, anyway, let me calm down. I'm not an orcon. I shouldn't be doing practicing my growls. I'm still here. I'm not dead yet. N Nick, Nick, are you okay? Speaking of which, my friend Crowdus is playing. Uh, Ark the Lad, Rise of Fan... Rise... No, not Ark the Lad, Rise of Fantasia. <laughs> Ark the Lad... The... Whatchamacallit... Why did I just randomly forget the title? Anyway, so... Uh, <laughs> annotation right here if you're interested in watching it. <laughs> Scared you, didn't I? Oh, it's a girl. Regent is such a cute tiger, isn't he? What's the matter? You two sure are quiet! What voice should I give her? Like, really, what voice? I guess I'll just give her this one. It's kind of like... It's kind of the same as my whatchamacallit voice, actually. It's kind of like my Mia voice. Don't! What's the matter, me? Erm, um, no, I should give her a different voice, because I shouldn't... Okay. Um... Hmm... Anyway. N Nick! He almost died here! There! Ha! Uh, ha! He wasn't anywhere close to getting hurt, let alone dying! This little tiger hardly ever bites people! And besides, people normally never get to play the wild tiger, right? So if you think about it, you're actually really lucky! Huh? You agree, don't you? I guess... Well, well what do you mean you guess? Or, well, what do you mean you guess? Why are you agreeing with her? Woohoo! Your costume! Eh? It's cute! I want to try it on! c cost Er... Co good costume? You mean my clothes? You don't mind letting me try it on, right? Uh, I guess not. Really? <laughs> You're the best! Wow, the tables turned quickly on that one. So much for the tiger thing. You know what, just for the sake of differentiation, I'm gonna give her my Rita voice simply because Morgan Fay. We're, not we're probably not gonna be seeing her anytime soon. Oh, I almost forgot to introduce myself! I'm Regina Berry, the renowned animal tamer at the Berry Big Circus. My name's Maya Fay. I'm a spirit medium. Phoenix, er, Phoenix Wright, attorney at law. When you when you put us next to an animal tamer, I bet we really look odd. N nice to meet you. Uh, likewise. Okay. First off, before we begin, are you aware that I'm a lawyer? What about this? What can you t What about this? What can you tell me? Um, I'm not really good at figuring out how out hard. Or, <laughs> um, I'm not really good at figuring out hard things. Okay, you're not. You're, she's clearly not Rita. Really? You too? I understand exactly what you mean. I never expected Maya to make a new friend in a strange place like this. Okie dokie then. Before we begin, 
Let me just examine a few things. A ladder! Don't walk under the ladder or it's bad luck! Ah, a ladder! It's just a step ladder. What's the difference? They do the same thing, right? I think you should stick with the basic facts of the matter. Oh? Uh, okay. It's not even worth arguing with her on this one. Okay. A lion head! Not to be confused with the, the uh, game developer. Look, that's where Max go comes out during the show! I've got to admit, that was a pretty cool effect. We're planning for me to start coming out of the lion during the show. That's great, Regina. Yeah, I will ride on Regent's back and jump out of the lion's mouth. I want to try it too. I'll ride on Nick's back and jump out of the lion's mouth. Sometimes I wonder about this girl. I really do too. Okay. First of all, let me let me before let me gather how old she is, if it will even let us know. Profiles. Okay. Let's see. Max is 21. Oh, so he's just uh. I'm turning 20 this year, so he's just like a year older than me. Regina Barry is 16 years of age. Just a year older than Rita. That's two strikes, lady! You're proving less and less to be Rita each time! Well, then again, Morgan Faye wasn't very much of a Rita either, but I still gave her the voice. Okay. No clues here. The hitbox is just below, right here. Is that still the ladder? Hey, it's a- Hey, it's a rope! Probably for tightrope walk walking. That's a bit strange. There weren't any tightrope walkers. Uh, there weren't any tightrope walkers in the show when we saw it. Okay. What about this? Is this nope? Okay. What is this? Nothing. What is this? The seats are kind of far away, don't you think? Th they are, but it also means that lots of people can fit in the big top. He's right. We can fit 500 people into a show. 500? That's amazing. Flying around above that many people is a real rush. At least that's what Max said. What if she's a murderer? Now that would be interesting. What about this? Whoa! Those lights are huge! I love lights! Whenever I appear under the spotlight, everyone claps for me! That's because everyone knows that you're cute! No, I'm not cute. You're cute! Me? Of course! I'm sure you'd make an incredible heroine! Really? You think so? Nick, did you hear that? Me! A heroine! What about Nick, Regina? Mmm, hmm, Nick... He's no hero, is he? Ouch! Thanks a lot, Maya! Okie dokie, then. I think that's everything that we can examine. So let's go- uh, let's go ahead and talk to you, Miss Any Mini. I said Any Mini on purpose, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sure someone's like, Oh, you're so silly! Any Mini was in the previous case! Hey, Regina! What do you know about the what happened last night? You mean the murder? Uh-huh. My dad was murdered. I can't imagine how hard that- I can't imagine how hard that must be for you- Ugh! That was insensitive! I don't get how that was insensitive- That's right! That's right! The ringmaster was your- Yep, the ringmaster was my dad. I'm so sorry about what happened to him. I gotta love how slow the text scrolls. Why do you say you're sorry? Eh? Anyways, everyone was here practicing last night. Even your dad? Yes, everyone was here. We finished up around 10 p.m. After that, okay, 10 p.m. After that, everyone went off on their own. I was the only one who stayed around here. Why did you do that? I was playing with Re with Regent. Regent. So she was with that beast. That's when the police showed up. Or pfft, that's when the police showed up. When they took my me to check things out. Dad was dead. For someone whose father was just murdered, she seems awfully perky. I wish she would tell us more about her dad. Oh, maybe she's adopted. That'd be interesting. Okay, so that's incredible that you are an animal tamer. If you say so. It has to be really scary. Scary? Why? Huh? Regent isn't scary, he's cute! Ever since Leon, Leon died, Regent has been my best friend. Leon? Kennedy? Yes, Leo, er, as in Leo the Lion, Leon the Lion, I see. Yes, Leon the Lion. Leon the Lion, Regent and Regina. Interesting name choices. Leon, he died? Yes, actually he was killed. My dad killed him. What? Er, that's Phoenix. What? Why did he do that? 
I'm not sure why he did it. It's tough not to get charmed when she looks- or er, it's tough not to get charmed when she looks like at you with those innocent eyes. Okie dokie then. Um... Just real curious, just real quick, I want to, uh... Hey, real quick. Hey, let me tell you, let me ask you something, real quick. A fabulous magi magician na famed for his aerial illusions accused of murder. What do you have to say about Brian Roscoe? It's Max! Hey, where is Max now anyways? Y you don't know? Nope! He's been arrested. He was charged with the murder of your father. It's okay. Nick and I will help him. Max isn't the guy, is he? I mean, the criminal? Of course he's not. I'm worried about so many things right now. Hmm, like what? <laughs> that was an ugly giggle. Okay, what happens if I present you? Alright, I look so cute in this picture. Don't you, oh, don't you think I look cute, don't you? Don't you? You sure do! No objections here! Alright, Russell Berry. Age 52, Mel, the victim and the ringmaster of the Berry Big Circus, Regina's, Regina Berry's father. After, after practice is over, Dad went right back to his room. His room? Yes. That door right over there leads to the ringmaster's room. Hmm. I don't know why, but he went off to this room in a hurry. I wonder what happened. That seemed more like my raven voice than my uh, Rita voice. The ringmaster, the ringmaster's room. It's probably a good idea to check it out for myself. Alrighty then. Let's go ahead. That's all the information that we can get here, unless like maybe she has anything else to say. No, she does. What's on your mind? Regina, what's the matter? What's on your mind? <laughs> Listen, I'm just gonna keep doing that stupid giggle just because I tell you, Maya, but she, but just, I'll tell you, Maya, but just you. Ah! Um, well... What? Really? And then... Oh my, that's incredible, Regina! Come on, Nick, there's no reason to pout! Don't worry about me. Regina told me that someone professed their love to her. P -p -p professed their love? Not only that, it was... Maya, you sure know how, don't know how to keep your mouth shut, do you? It was Maximilian Galactica! I wonder how many people have stolen one of his hearts any anyways. And then, on the exact same day, another person professor left it for her as well! What? Who was it? Someone named Trilo. Trilo? Apparently he is a tenor, a tenor who sings in the circus! Hmm, haven't met him yet. Regina seems to be quite the hit with the man- quite the hit with the men in this circus! She m she must have some sort of strange power over them. I'm going to assume that it's her massive amount of ego. You're not- er, what? What? You're not kidding! Two people in one day? Even I want to profess my love for her! Me too! She's so cute! Except that's illegal, Phoenix! That is illegal! And you know what else is illegal? Not ending an episode off with an awkward pause. So anyone who's ever done videos before and hasn't ended an episode off with an awkward pause, I'm going to report you to the police. Anyway, whatever the case would be, <clears throat> I'll see you guys in the next episode. <clears throat>